In this lesson, I want to explain the measurement tool for avatar and the garment. Here is tools. Uh, as you can see, we have uh, uh, two measurement tools and their edit tools. First measurement tool, as you can see, we have lots of measurement tool here. That's a special for avatar. Another measurement tool is for garment. First, I explain the garment. If you select a linear measurement, uh, I have to exit that for the garment. A linear measurement of the garment. It's very easy. <clears throat> for example, you design a garment and you want to linear this me measurement distance, for example, from this shoulder to the this shoulder. As you can see, it's directly measurement, not uh, in the curve. It's a single line for example here to the here as you can see okay this linear tool is just linear uh, another interesting tool is circumference okay circumference of measurement of gamma avatar is here for example uh, if you click here as you can see you have a circumference of this part for measurement or you have uh, this part measurement as you can see in the centimeter and if you go into the edit tool you can select them and move them in any position that you want and if you select them you can read the uh, as you can see read the size so for a uh, garment we have just linear that does not uh, create a curve just linear and here in its edit you can delete them if you want it's very simple the other measurement is for avatar if you uh, we explain it later if you go into the avatar we have a complex measurement to uh, avatar it's an avatar editor as you can see it's here you can turn the garment here off to see it as you can see we have a complex measurement for avatar that's here you can change your avatar but here you for example you insert a custom avatar from your 3d program and here you can see the measurement tool for avatar for example a basic circumference measurement of avatar uh, it's a circumference for example you want to measurement the head here you can select in a guideline you for this circumference you need three points one two and as you can see for three point you can just drag don't need to click on that <coughs> you can hold shift to go to the exact line uh, if you want but in this case it does not work well so this is the circumference the basic surface as you can see if you click click and the second click you can measurement the surface circumference okay it's a circumference but not uh the surface the basic tape measurement <clears throat> click and click and click as you can see just double click to finish it and this is a straight line okay for example if you want to double click here as you can see it's a tape and it's very straight line for deleting then you have to go to the edit measurement and I explained it uh, how to attach the garment to the avatar uh, measurement to the garment you can go into the edit and select another measurement tool is surface <coughs> uh, tape measurement in avatar here and as you can see the difference between the um, previous tool it's it's going exactly on a surface of the avatar and um, with scale but the previous tool in a tape if you go in here it gives you a straight line okay <clears throat> another tool is a uh, linear measurement it's very straightforward it's linear it does not go for example this shoulder to the this shoulder and as you can see it's go exactly inside the outer it does not go on a surface 
Another interesting tool is the height me measurement. You can measurement at height from, for example, here to the ground, uh, hand to the ground, this button to the ground. Okay, you can uh, measurement the height of avatar that you insert with this measurement tool. And going to the edit tool and you can delete them if you wish. Okay, I want to explain how to attach this, this measurement to your avatar. It's very easy. For example, I want to use uh, this measurement for this avatar in basic circumference for this, for example, neck. And that's okay. And turn the avatar on, I, I turn the uh, garment on. And here, if I go to the edit tool of the um, avatar measurement, you can attach to measurement. It's very simple. First, select the tool. The measurement is active now. You have to select which segment of the avatar select first to attach to the, this uh, measurement line. And if you simulate, as you can see, this edge of avatar is going to attach that measurement line that you create. Okay. First, select the tool, select the segment, and then select the measurement line or anything that you selected here. For example, you can create a surface tape measurement here to the here. Double click to finish, and you want to attach it this segment to the this at, uh, and done. Okay. Okay. These are the measurement tool for the avatar and the measurement tool for garment. And these are the edit tools of them. In a but in the edit tool for the measurement and avatar, we have another tool called attach to measurement. That's it. Okay, I forgot uh, to tell you something in garments. Sorry, if you select a garment, as you can see, it's like a straightforward. It's uh, perpendicular to this. For example, if you want to uh, uh, measurement this part, what can I do? Going to the edit, uh, select it, and select it anywhere that you want, and the gizmo is calm. And here you can rotate it in any direction that you want to uh measurement for example this part bring it here and try to just uh, this part going to the this tool and as you can see it's measure this part for you it's here okay if you want to so you can simply go to the edit tool don't go to the select tool if you go into the select tool this, this disappear you have to go to the edit tool of this and here you can uh, select it and select it, click it anywhere. And here you can uh, rotate it. And because it is a circumference, you have to uh, make sure that this uh, does not happen because it's measurement these uh, lines uh, plus this, okay? Uh, make sure that you cover just as area that you want with this uh, green tool and it gives you that measurement or for example if you want to measure this part you can go again select it for example behind shoulder to shoulder okay going to the edit tool select it click it to bring it and here you can measurement this part to the this part with this nice Okay, make sure that you just uh, intersect with this part that you want. Or you can rotate it and bring it exactly shoulder to shoulder measurement. And here you can specify the um, measurement of this part of the garment exactly. Okay.
Hello my friends, to continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now, you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.